Hey, I thought I'd try and attempt a quick video here because it's really windy today. Well, it has been really, really windy and it's just kind of doing some pauses. So I thought I could get a video in here because this is one of the most important features of our property. Um, so this is the hedging that we have at the front. So I'm facing, you know, I'm facing perfectly northwest at the moment. Um, so the strongest wind we have blows straight towards us. It's very warm and very dry in Canterbury. Uh, let's wait for that to go past. <laughs> and um, gets very very strong gusts we'd typically get up to 120 kilometers an hour winds um, well fairly frequently during the summer so we realized that when we first moved in here for that wind to die back again <laughs> um, and we planted this massive hedge area so um, here we have um, pinus panea um, stone pine um, hopefully we'll eventually get our own pine nuts off this but also i'll probably top it and create a hedge along here. As you can see, we've got um, three of them along here. Um, and behind it, there are um, hazelnut trees. Um, obviously, nut production, great. We seem to lose most of them onto the ground, to be honest. Um, and then in behind that is a native plant called um, Grisolinia littoralis, which is um, grows here natively, so grows crazy, really goes crazy, and forms a very dense hedge. I've got a double row of them on this side of the drive and a double row on the other side to um, provide wind protection. So if I go out from there um, without falling over and have a look at the other side of the drive is exactly the same. So um, this provides a massive double um, layer of protection for the wind coming into our garden and protecting the rest of the garden across here. Obviously there's still some areas we need to protect but we've got trees um, here which are perfectly positioned to do that over time. They're quite big and quite dense natives and obviously they're growing like crazy as well. Um, so uh, we've also got a curved driveway here so as the wind blows in this end of the driveway uh, it swirls around and leaves and uh, um, <laughs> other people's garden rubbish are deposited in here. Unfortunately that also means we get a fair bit of recycling but uh, <laughs> at least some of it is paper rubbish. So um, so that's basically what it and if the wind will let me just finish um, we should have over time a really really dense thick um, hedging here that's double layered that really protects the garden from the strongest wind and uh, keeps all of the water on the garden because it's um, it's just such an important factor in this in this sort of environment. Anyway, cheers.